Hello. Hello. So here we are, Sarah and I, today we're going to be talking to you guys about something that everybody is undergoing on mm -hmm. daily basis. But very few do something about it. And that something is stress. Sarah. Well, this is something that really has been a great concern to me for many years because I think actually women in a way suffer more stress than men. There's a lot of scientific research now that actually says that, you know, the way our brains actually deal with stress and the, the need to express ourselves that we, we have when we're stressed is now, and the, the lack of ability we have to do it, means that we actually are more stressed as women than actually our male counterparts. And the rise of so many women who are very, basically successful in the workplace and coming home to then being mothers at home and and partners and wives at homes means that we're we're running two roles again that really increases our stress so for me your ability to deal with stress to have really good positive um, stress for stress reducing techniques in place is absolutely essential and my coaching program which is called magnificence the 12 steps to high performance and low stress really deals with actually what's going on within our mind that causes us stress because there are a multitude of stress management techniques up there now you know we can look at our diet we can look at exercising we can look at reducing our working hours cutting down our time spent on technology learning a little bit of mindfulness but the reality is those techniques they've been around for ages and stress is getting actually more and more severe as time goes by so for me, stress is about really being able to witness our thinking, to take control of our thoughts, so that when a situation, such a stressful situation arises, we have some techniques in place that are at the level of our mind, at the level of our thinking, that help us deal with it effectively. And you know, one really simple thing is just to turn things that are worrying us into intentions or even prayers for their positive opposite you know instead of worrying that you're going to be really late for the meeting put the intention out there i'm going to get to that meeting on time just swinging the negative into the positive is just a simple thing that you can do at the level of your thought to help you overcome stress tony i know it's something that's of great concern to you what are, what are your thoughts on stress now well like what you mentioned it's uh, stress affects both genders both male and mm -hmm. female genders and uh, one of the greatest things to support your claim about uh, women being stressed quite a lot. I coach a lot of women who are single mothers. Mm -hmm. Now, and I actually adore and admire them with the amount of energy they have mm -hmm. and the amount of stress that they have to deal on a daily basis. Mm -hmm. Now, I coach coaches, I coach doctors, I coach women leaders and everything else. And when I really start coaching them, I look at them and I say, wow, how on earth you can do all of those multitude of tasks mm -hmm. and then come to that space where it's really calm and loving and efficient. When you have your children screaming at you for attention, mm -hmm. uh, your job people are screaming for you for attention, yeah. yourself is screaming for you for your own attention, your family is screaming at you, mm -hmm. your friends are screaming at you, the society is screaming at you. So I do believe uh, that to help all of those women and people in general with stress, it's about really understanding, first of all, what is the most effective way to lead your life on a daily basis. Because all of those tasks and all of those demands would not be without you in it. Now, stress causes a lot of illness. And there are much more specialists out there who can actually go into the details of what stress does to the human body. But as a healer, I have worked with so many people where they have a lot of back tension, a lot of headaches, a lot of migraines, a lot of emotions, uh, weight mm -hmm. problems, digestion problems, breathing problems, and the list goes on, including addictions such as smoking and alcohol and drugs. Now, all of those stress the body. So the entire environment around you stresses the body. So for you to get into that space of distressing the body, it is essential to daily take at least 
one hour me time. And in that me time, allow yourself to love yourself. Allow yourself to do your meditation, to go for a yoga, to go for you know, a nice walk in the countryside, or simply call a friend that you really have a connection like Sarah and I. So stress is a problem number one in our society. Mm, yes. Now both Sarah and I run programs which can help you overcome the stressful environments. My program, Intrusion Free Living and The Power of Being, mm -hmm. it's about really taking you through the multiple layers that actually cause stress and inspiring you from within to access tools mm -hmm. that you can use them instantly not to generate stress. Wouldn't that be amazing? You have Sarah and Tony together mm -hmm. to actually go through the entire organization and manage the stress and literally take you from stress to success. Yes, from stress to success, that's a great way. So I hope just those thoughts that we share with you there have really been of value and uh, we look forward to speaking to you again. Thank uh, you very much. Absolutely. Thank you, Sarah. And we love you and thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye.